Hey everybody, it's your boy Kev, and welcome to another gaming iteration of KKS Gaming. Today I thought we'd do something a little different and play one of my favorite games, Torchlight 2. This is a game that is like nearest and dearest to my heart, and something that I've enjoyed for many, many years. Well, not so many years, but a few years since the game has came out. Well, since the first game. And I like dungeon crawlers, I've played a little bit of Diablo 3, but I've always found myself coming back to this game because it is so, so much fun. Um, customization is pretty decent, and you can even have pets, so that's always good. Uh, today I'm going to start off with a brand new character, something that, you know, you know like I, I try to start every now and again. I'd usually jump back into my old characters and kind of like progress the story a little bit but I decided I'd try a brand new character and I usually play with either the gunslinger which is the, which is the outlander which is ranged weapons or the engineer which has pretty which also is ranged but it has really good me uh, uh, melee skills but for this playthrough I thought I would go with a strictly melee on focus character so I'm gonna go with the old berserker. Yeah, yeah, he's all he's all in it. Yeah. So I usually go with male, but this time I'm gonna go with the lady. Oh, isn't she just wonderful, isn't she? Yes. Demure, wonderful, just just amazing. Anyway, let's check. Let's go with. Yeah, that's a nice skin tone. Some cute hairdo. I like the mohawk. Mohawk works pretty good. Okay. We'll do we'll go with that. And uh let's see. As for the name No. Let's see. Let's do, uh... Do Caddy... Southpaw. Oh, Caddy Southpaw, that's what we're going with. And, uh... Yeah, it's a lot more customization when it comes to pets now. Uh... Yeah, you can go with a lot of different variations of pets, like... Beyond Hawks, Owl, Badger. Let's go with like a Badger. Cause Badger, cause Honey Badger, he don't care. He don't care at all. He's in it. Let's say Marbles. It's a sucky name for a Badger. Uh, let's see what was. Let's call him Sunflash, cause he reminds me of a. Badger, they remind me of a uh, a Brian Jock book I used to read back in the day, like Eluthia, which is uh whose name was Sunflash the Mace, so he was an awesome badger, so I go and name him Sunflash. Uh, I played this before, so we're gonna go probably gonna go veteran to give it some flavor, single player of course. Gathered. Yeah, whatever. We don't really care about the story. If anyone cares about the story, you know where to go. But this is, we're not caring about the story. We're talking about gameplay. This is KKG stuff. That's what we're going with. What's your business here? Yeah, this big guy's the destroyer, isn't he? Yeah, man. Oh, quest. This won't hurt I think bit. this is as far as I can go. You should carry on to the Asterian Enclave. But you're on your own. Yeah. Asterian Enclave, yeah. Nice. 
Yeah. slap a rat. So that's what I like about pets. They really can come into you and you can you can augment them with spells and but they have they have their own armor set, so Man is low. Man is low. And of course, the sweet loot. You never you can have a dungeon crawler game without some sweet loot. I love the I like the loot in this game. Jacked up this place really well. Ooh, wow. Everything is gone. Can't just come out of nowhere on me like that. Oh, yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Fall back. Fall back. Here. Oh cool, they were Oh cool, they were fighting themselves. NPCs were fighting. Getting them, getting them, getting them. Getting them. You know what time it is. Not enough. Ooh, I'm about to die. Take that blood beast. Ooh, ah, ooh, ah. ooh. Yes, I got some sweet loot. Take that. I like about this this game looks really nice it's very smooth very pretty you know simple simple grass graphics and textures but it looks really good from a standpoint like, is it better than Diablo eh, it's so it's it's good on its own merits and it's really good on its own merits you have become more experienced and I enjoy it a lot. And one thing for sure, it's definitely cheaper and very easy to get into, as opposed to a a Diablo three. Diablo. The first first third slide was pretty good, but it was lacking in a lot of ways because it didn't have like a lot of the customization. It had only like three classes, and those classes were basically like character. These like character types as opposed to like classes that you can take and make of your own. But this is actually pretty good. And 
I recommend if you can play the first Torchlight because it's really, it really is a good game. But if you're just, but if you want something new and fresh, I, I suggest you can't, you can't go with Torchlight. Too. Go in second and you can enjoy yourself all day. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. What? Ooh. Dang, that rock had a lot of stuff underneath that. Ah. Let's see. Ah, oh, look at all that. Look at all that stuff. Let's see. I think this is. I think this is a nice, quiet spot where I can uh, rest for a second. Step on these two things and uh, do my skills. Uh, I guess, let's see, eviscerate, yeah, give me some of that, uh, blood hunger, you ready, Good job, man. yeah, give me some of that, yeah, so these are pretty decent skills, okay, now, I guess since that I am a, I guess since I'm a Berserker, I have to put more into weapon damage, so I'm going to put some into Strength. And I believe some into Dexterity. A little bit more Strength. Uh, vitality for Health. Because I'm probably going to... And then... Uh, one point. And then maybe some in Focus. Yeah, I think that'll work. If you think that I'm wrong for that, please leave me in, please leave it in the contents comments I'm sorry all right let's see oh another really cool thing about torchlight that I really like is when you like find yourself full of stuff that you don't need you can just set you can just right you can just shift right shift click and it goes to the pets inventory right here and if you find yourself deep in to a level and you don't want to quit then you can just go ahead and send the dog you can click this button here I mean this icon here and it sends the dog sends your pet I didn't, I didn't mean I didn't mean to call you a dog sunflash I didn't mean it uh, it sends your pet to home I mean not home but sends your um, pet to the town and they can s and he can sell the items for you and he can also buy items too in the shopping list. And this is the shopping list right here. So it shows you can he can buy mana, uh, health potions, mana potions, identify identify scrolls, and waypoint scrolls, which are really good for like opening portals back in the town when you're deep in the dungeons. But also an identity scroll is really good because there's a lot of items that that you can't identify. So it's also good to buy those too. Sometimes those are really. Sometimes when you like, oh, there's a question mark under that item, then you can't. Then it's like, oh, I don't know what that item is. So that pretty much identifies the item, so it makes it so it tells you what you got, and then it makes it even more uh, value, gives more value. I know I'm rambling, but I'm trying to get my thoughts together when I make this. Sorry, y'all. Um, I'm new, still working out the kinks, but stick with me. I'm getting better. I'm getting more comfortable with this. This is really good. But um, looking at my timer, I believe that's a good. This is a good place to stop for right now. I get you a little taste of Torchlight. See how you feel about it. About Torchlight 2. Anyway, um, please like and subscribe to my channel. If you like this video, please like it. If you don't like it, please hit don't like. But hey, views are views, and I'm appreciated. Um, anyway. I will talk at you later. Me and Sunflash are gonna talk at you later, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye, y'all.